Uh, 10th win of the month uh, of December for you guys. Uh, Sacramento had a big season, but how did you guys feel this month? I was fully ran and executed. Uh, got the stops we needed. That was a quick time to take advantage of that. And uh, that was just a good night for us. We do it. That was strange, especially in the third quarter. Well, why are the games in Sacramento kind of so tough to get through? Just guessing. I don't know, but you realize it's tough. Uh, they come down, they get a lot of opportunities, they get a lot of threes. So. What was your uh, opinion about the players that you are starting to go back? First time to the starters, so it's good to see them go on to the team. How much easier does it make your job when you have a 6 foot 10 guy moving, uh, cutting like that? I think you find him with the basketball team with a nice look. How much easier does it make your job humble than he is? Very easy. Him, JG, uh, Paul, uh, all those guys, I sent the screen for some really fine. Yeah. Have you felt that there's some gravity to him when he plays alongside you guys? When Porter plays, when he pulls some defenders away from you, have you felt that gravity that he draws? Do uh, you know what I'm saying? Does he attract the defense's attention uh, when he's playing alongside the starters? Have you felt it easier for you? Um, yeah, I mean, not really. He's a good scorer. Put well since Sandra uh, from the perimeter. Other than that, no, we, our team is just past cutting. It doesn't matter who's cutting who's mm -hmm. you'll look, you call the Jokic is behind the back and then behind the back until they read that one. I was just trying to stop screaming. Yeah, I was trying to stop screaming. He's got a very handy. Jamal, you, you said at media day that it was sort of desperation to make the playoffs is what fueled you guys last year and that you would have to stay hungry going into this year. You're on an even greater pace for wins this year. What, what's been, you think, overall some of the biggest driving factors that have, that have led to, you know, being 23 and 9? Uh, we're just locked in. Uh, we know who we are. We feel like we have every single game. We have the team. We have the opportunity. Uh, we have the fans behind us. We go on the road. And we do great at the next game. So we're staying poised and uh, I'm not good to the yard, so it's nice to stay A few weeks ago, you mentioned you had taken a fall, and then you mentioned that it was taking a toll on your body a little bit more. You took a big fall tonight. Um, is it that point in the season where you're starting to feel kind of tired? Uh, not me, but you know, that's when we started to see guys go down. Um, you know, sacks to have guys hurt, and we have guys going down right now. Fall rate of the knee got hurt, so you know, I come soft every day. Um, uh, I think this point, seeing 30 games in, we started seeing fatigue and we am about to react to you know, being tired. So, this is about my injuries, not just for us, but you know, the team is going to be. Jamal, you guys are one nine the last 10, uh, but you know, not a lot of talk about you guys outside of Denver. Do you prefer to kind of fly into the radar a bit? I don't really care. Let's go there and move. I just like to play basketball. I don't know what you guys talk about some of that. Um, really can't do anything about it. So, yeah, Thank you. Thank you, Jamal. Thank you, Jamal. Thank you, Jamal. Thank you, Jamal.